two incredibly common conditions you're going to see as a nurse are angina and myocardial infarction. Now, while they have some similarities, there's some key differences that you need to keep in mind. So angina is chest pain that results from inadequate blood flow. Now, myocardial infarction, on the other hand, is more serious. It's when a portion of the heart is receiving no oxygen-rich blood at all, uh, and it's often because of blockage to one of these main uh, vessels. So with angina, you're going to see chest pain, and generally this chest pain is going to be relieved by rest, and you're also going to see dyspnea on exertion. Now remember, they're not getting oxygen-rich blood to their heart. Now because of what's going on with the heart, you're also going to see changes to blood pressure, and you're going to see arrhythmias. Now with myocardial infarction, you're going to see things like chest pain, which is unrelieved by rest, and it might uh, radiate out, especially into the arms. You're going to see pale skin, diaphoresis, and palpitations with activity. We're also going to want to make sure we run an EKG, and most importantly, you're going to see these elevated troponins like CKMB and CKMB. If you're looking to expand your knowledge about the cardiovascular system and cardiovascular pharmacology, head over to nursing.com slash heart, where you can take quizzes to see where you stand, download cheat sheets, and watch videos by experienced and practicing nurses on this information. Go out and be your best self today. Happy nursing.